Hey you guys, we're back with another video. So y'all wonder why I'm talking kind of low. It's just because my doors are open in my classroom. But I wanted to show y'all because I am going to be doing um, setting up my classroom with me video. As y'all can see by the title, obviously. Um, I want to show y'all like a walkthrough of my classroom without anything here. Um, I do have a couple things on my desk right here, but that's just my stuff for today. Mine and my mother's stuff because we work together. So yeah, I'm about to move my desk. I'm trying to remember how I wanted them because I did set it up on my iPad, but unfortunately my iPad's at home and I didn't send the picture to myself on my phone. So I think I can remember because I know I only want like six groups of um, of tables. So I only made like six groups of little, what they call it? Table groups or whatever. So yeah, and y'all, they did not, they literally took my desk out of my room. So my desk out of my room and my like little rolly chair. I don't even have a rolly chair. They put them in the room across the hall from me. So I have to ask the janitors to move them, move my desk back into my room. Please and thank you ASAP immediately. Yeah, so let me show y'all. Let me flip this camera and show y'all my whole room. All right, so this is like where you guys walk in. This is the entrance and stuff. Um, because I teach science, if y'all don't already know, um, I have like these lab tables all the way around my room. And then I have the individual desk right here. If it's about two or four students, if you want two on both sides, but they're all together. So I'm about to move those. We have the monitor and stuff like that. My whole whiteboard. Um, we have a little TV, but we don't ever use that because we got this new one right here. This is where my desk is gonna be. So um, I do have like a teacher model. So like my students will have their versions over there all around the room. Like I said, I teach science. But this one right here is mine. Um, I don't really use this ever. I just use like the tops of it. I don't use this sink. Um, I have like file cabinets, you know, regular cabinets all around the room. It's real basic. Um, back there is a little storage room between me and my boss. And yeah, that's just my whole classroom. And as y'all can see, I have great, 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 um, what is it called? Lighting in my room. Right now my lights are on, but I'm gonna show y'all what like when my lights off. That's my lights off. It don't even look that much of a difference. So hold on, let me show you. So this is my lights off. This is my lights on. Off, on, no difference. Um, so I really love that about my classroom because I don't have to always have the lights on and I kind of want to do that this year and I had the lights on too much. Um, but this is with all my windows up. Like my blinds are completely up as y'all saw. Um, I don't always have my blinds up, but when I do, y'all see the lighting. So, let me go ahead and move these desks around and figure out how I want them real quick. y'all don't remember where i want my desk and i have them like this so it's gonna be group one um group one over here group two group three and then my back um lab tables and i'm gonna go ahead and move this tv onto the other side move some stuff around y'all and i put a desk over here because that's going to be like their student center where their pencils, sharpeners, erasers, like everything they could think of is gonna be over there. Even, um, what do you call it? Even, oh, like hygiene materials, stuff like that, like lotions, um, hand sanitizer, feminine products, stuff like that. Stuff is gonna be over there for them. So if they need it, they know they can go over there and get it. Um, so I would never put anything over there that they cannot touch. Um, 
they can touch all that stuff as long as it's not interrupting class or whatever for the most part they got it um but i i think i might call my boyfriend and see if he like this makes me look so dark but i thought i'm gonna call my boyfriend and see if he can send me the picture on my ipad because i kind of want to move my chair i don't play dealing with that tomorrow but it's not that big of a deal i can't people moving their desk up um above me which is crazy because they said don't slide your desk across the floor because they just waxed the floor and they don't want you to mess it up but um obviously people just don't give a fuck um I want to put these two tables in the missing area, but then they won't get part of the comp. I don't know. What are you going? Hold on. Good morning, you guys. Um, I'm in an elevator right now. The elevator makes so much noise. I just got a cart so I can go grab my stuff out of my car. Y'all won't see it in a second. If you won't be back in my classroom, if you actually start. So I just ate my breakfast. Um, and I'm going to start. Alright, before we get start decorating, y'all, there's so many people out in the hallway because they have like this um, meeting thing or whatever, and they filled up all our parking spots. Like, I'm so glad I got here when I got here because they filled up all our parking spots in the front, and they filled up all our parking spots in the back, and now that I'm moving on to like this other parking lot that's like um, right next door to us, but I'm going to be right back because um, my work sister but my sister has i'm using her card so i'm returning her card to her before i start decorating and i forget real quick just in case she has to use them all right y'all so it's pretty quiet um down here it's currently nine o'clock now i did waste like an hour and a half how you got like some people that y'all work with that like y'all can sit there and talk for hours yeah i was with those people so now we all separated because we needed to go decorate our rooms and go handle some stuff. TV, I'm probably just gonna play some music or whatever. Um, so I'm probably going to make it fast forward and I'll just voice over something. But I brought my iPad to school. So um, this, is my, this is my classroom before it was cleaned and stuff. So I took a picture like on the last day of school and I mapped out everything how I wanted it to look um and currently i'm gonna show y'all how i put the desks so right now i'm gonna just hold up like this right now i have like four fives one two three four five yeah five like sets of desk or whatever and stuff that's not how i want it because those two lonely desks can only fit like two people at them the way i want the chairs to yeah the way i want the chairs to sit so i'm going to move it like this um so i'll have more people in them even though it's going to be one lonely desk in the middle i'll just have those two people join another group versus having four people join another group it's just too much so i'm about to move those desks real quick because that's like the heavy labor 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 and then i'm going to start i should have bought like a measuring tape too but then i'm gonna start I don't know where I'm gonna start yet. Cause I got a good amount of stuff, y'all. I wanna start their student center over here. Excuse me, I'll start student center first. Um, but I do need some bulletin board paper. So I'm gonna do that. Taking, I always say, So they did bring my desk in. My phone was acting dumb, but 
basically i was just explaining to y'all i decided to do the u shape or the c shape whatever you want to call it because i wanted some distance between these students and, and me but i am going to bring it up just a little bit because my ocd is real bad so i need to like be able to have these desks even with these desks so let me go do that all right y'all so it finally took me I don't know how long it took me, but I got it together. Now we're gonna go over here. This corner right here is supposed to be like my uh, keep calm corner. So I have like a little rug up out from the house. It's real small. I thought it was gonna be a little bigger than this, but it's gonna serve its purpose for the time being. Um, I got this little mirror that my mom got from uh, all these. Let me close my door now. My door is open because the janitorial staff came in with my desk. So this is the mirror. I don't even know how I'm gonna hang it up. I might have to bring some command strips from home tomorrow. Actually, not even tomorrow. I'm going back to the house. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. I might have to bring some command strips. But this mirror right here is gonna be like an affirmation mirror because it's gonna be the affirmation station. Um, it has little sticky things. Um, I'm gonna map out how I want them so they have like I am honest, I am happy, I'm talented, stuff like that. So I'm about to lay them out, and then after that, then I'm gonna work on my student um, center area that I show you guys. So like, and then it has like you can see I am. I'm only talking a little fast because I am running out of storage on my phone. I did film a video the other day and y'all it was like 24 minutes long and I forgot to send it to my laptop so I can delete it off my phone. I might send it to my iPad since I got it here. But um yeah, we're gonna go ahead and figure this out. Um I'm gonna hit y'all back and show y'all what it what it looks like. All right, y'all, so this is my affirmation station. So I don't know if I should put affirmation station above I am or just no, just leave I am. But I think, I, I think I'm gonna put it. Um, and of course that little middle section is gonna be where the mirror is. But since I am going back to my house, um, I guess you could kind of say like halfway through the process, I'm going to try my best to remember to get some command strips. theme of my classroom this year is going to be inside out so i have all my emotions we got joy we have anger this one's going to be discussed even though i know it's not truly green they do have ones like these green but these are the ones i got first we have fear sadness and embarrassment at first i was going to do bing bong right here but i did embarrassment Trying to fit my theme, y'all. Trying to fit my theme. My best friend just got here, but she is probably saying hello to everybody because she hasn't been here. So. And I'm only going to do two. Oh, she's here. She is here. I thought she was going to say hello to everybody. Who's everybody? I don't know. I thought you saw somebody. All right, y'all, so this is what we got done today. I just put up this right here. It's gonna be for like my absent 
work and stuff like that. I'm gonna have date, objective, agenda. I just haven't put them up yet. This is my desk right here, real plain, nothing crazy for real. Got my little prize stuff. I have more prizes. Um, I just bought some more, just went to the dollar store. All my little emotions are hanging up. Y'all can see them. I see I got joy, museum in fear, embarrassment, sadness over there. Look at him. Disgust, all that. So I didn't do much and I did put together their boxes, whatever. We just put like a little bit of crayons in there and just divided them evenly. I couldn't find one more. So yeah. Over here, I did do my at least the basic part of it, like the border and stuff over here. Forgot my freaking command strips at the house, so I'm gonna bring them tomorrow. Then that is that my carpet. So just like the little area itself. Real cute, real simple. And that's just my classroom right here. Um, we'll be back tomorrow to work on some more. Like I said, I just went to the dollar store. So I just got some hygiene stuff for my students and stuff like that. And some more stuff I can put up. Um, and I'm gonna work tonight. Sorry, I have a really bad angle. I'm trying to leave, I'm in a rush. Tonight, I'm going to be working on um, like stuff that I have to print out. That way, I can just print them out as soon as I get here. We have a full day ahead of us. And then from um, 4 to 6 is our back to school night. So, yeah. So, stay tuned. Here we are, day two. Skin is glowing. It's really giving, though. Like, golly. Period. Of uh, classroom setup. And it's also back to school night so stay with me with that too i don't know this is my first back to school night i never had one of those before <laughs> y'all hey, saw me bring in a bunch of stuff that's because we went somewhere for like free stuff that they give out to teachers i'm trying to fix this camera Oh, my boss is here. And, y'all, I lost my keys, my, like, work keys. And I think it's at the bottom of the bag. I'm going to say misplaced, because I'm praying at the bottom of the bag. Yes, we found out, we found out, we found out. We did it, we did it, we did it, yay! All right, I got my keys. Good, that was nice and quick. I love to see that. Um, anywho... I got all this stuff, whatever, from the freaking place. You know, I gotta start the day off, right? I gotta go eat breakfast. My breakfast sandwich is upstairs with my mother. So I'm about to go upstairs real quick. Um, I forgot to show y'all the some other stuff that we just decided to do. Well, I didn't do this one thing. So this right here in front of my desk is gonna be like how I keep track of like each student's rewards and stuff, like incentives and stuff like that. So it's all my classes, cause I have Oh my gosh, I'm thinking I had six of them up. It's literally five. That's ghetto. That's okay, because I think I'm gonna put a cart, I'm gonna put my cart over here, and I'll put the last one up. I'm thinking I had literally six of the freaking charts up. I only had five of them up. But um, yeah, I'm gonna leave my stuff down here, because I don't got time to be lugging this back and forth. So, let me go ahead, I'm going upstairs. Oh, the lighting, my bad, y'all. Forgot my lighting, it's this way. I'm going upstairs to my mom's room to eat breakfast and then I'm gonna come back for down here. I'm gonna be back down here about like eight o'clock probably. It's currently like 7.30 something. All right, y'all, I'm back in my room. It's actually like 8.30 or whatever. So it's been like an hour, but that's because they gave us some um, supplies for the school year and they gave us shirts for our back to school night. I'm gonna show y'all a little bit later. Right now I'm about to start doing their student center poster. I mean, bulletin board. So like I told y'all, we gotta really get the work done. Thursday back. It was all giggles and stuff. Um, we getting to work now.
Gym center is coming together. Coming together, not together. Um, I use all my batteries. Didn't think I was gonna use them all, but I did. Y'all, look. So hopefully these work. So for the bathroom, I'm gonna have this dry erase board. I'm just gonna put this. I have to put like a different tape on it because it's not staying to the wall. This wall sucks. So if a girl is out to the bathroom, they're going to press on it. I know a girl is out. If a boy is out to the bathroom, they're gonna press that. And then they have to write their name on the board so I know specifically who is out, you feel me? And who's not allowed to use the bathroom no more because y'all using y'all privileges. And this year, so usually in classes, you're only supposed to let one student out at a time, but I try to give them grace and I let one girl out, one boy out, that's all, okay? So two people at a time. For me, not, you're not technically supposed to, but hey. But anyway, um, so I'm gonna do it like that again. If it comes to the point where I can only do one, then they'll break the repercussions later on and other people are gonna be upset because they can't use the bathroom because the student's not back. And they're gonna realize that they cannot use the bathroom no more. Oh, so hopefully they're not selfish and they come back from the bathroom when they're supposed to. All right, y'all, we're going to put together our hygiene stuff. We got tissues, we got lotion, that's gonna be in that student center. We got feminine product, y'all need to see all that. What else? We got some deodorant for my boys. But don't think my girl's gonna be out here stinking either. I got some deodorant for my girls. What else do we get? That's all we got from the dollar store. I also got some more of these tissues. I got these tissues as well. And then, from the little free thing I told y'all about. So you should get uh, coffee from for you, me, and um, P. No, I'm supposed to get that one. Oh, okay. And then they gave all these little toiletry kits. It comes with shampoo, ooh, shampoo, a soap bar, a little comb, toothbrush, toothpaste, and what's this? A single dose of something. What's this? Oh, a hand wipe. Ain't that cute, y'all? That's cute. And then they come with like little. I also grabbed some little deodorant. You grab little deodorant? Sure did. They look like these. I don't know how they smell, but it's probably you know anything better than funk. Oh, that's not too bad. You smell them? Yeah, they have very mild scent. Yeah. So I'm gonna give out these first, cause at the beginning of the year you shouldn't be smelling like that. And then if it gets down to it where they start, you know, going through puberty and gym and stuff like that, then we can start handing out these. Um... more prizes we got some cool looking pencils some more pens sticky hands yo-yo play-doh little stress balls candy and a little pop it let's get to it all right y'all so it's about like 145 ish or whatever it is time to do like final final touches my room is pretty much together. I'm gonna show y'all like in more in depth in a minute. Behind me is my chill zone. I have to do a chill zone up there, student center over there, and my name on my desk. Um, but we're gonna do this first. So I need some Vaseline so bad. Um, so on here, we're gonna be doing the emotions going straight down and like what they can do to control their emotions depending on the emotions that they're feeling so i'm just doing the basic ones i'm just going to do fear sadness anger joy and disgust um and then on this side of the screen i'll show you like my inspiration i also have a couple other like stuff that i'm going to be um hanging up 
like this right here. They have to ask three before me, meaning three other people in the classroom. They ask yourself, what's the answer? They don't understand how to um, understand it better. They can ask two other people at the table. If they have not asked those two other people in their cells, then they, um, after that, then they can ask me. This will go above like who's going out to the bathroom or whatever. Um, this one here is gonna be above their turn in bin they have one last look they make sure that their name their date their class period and their best effort is put onto that worksheet um right here is going to go on my board i do need to eliminate them but for right now i'm probably going to just leave it regular and then when i get my free time during the school year i'm going to laminate them um, and then i'm going to have a lost and found haven't decided what bucket it's going to be in yet I will have a lost and found um, in case they lose anything because I have so much stuff left over. Um, and then last but not least, I'm going to number all of my tables. All right, you guys. So this is the end of day two. It's currently back to school night. So I'm about to really show you guys around real quick um, before the parents start coming in because the parents have started coming in, but not to our classrooms. I think I hear some parents, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video real quick. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you get notified when I post a video. Sorry, I'm talking fast, you guys. I just don't want to be caught by a parent recording a video. So, yes, I love you guys. Stay tuned for the rest of my videos on my channel. And as I said, I usually say, don't forget to stay true, stay you, and stay blessed. Peace. Hey, um. I don't know, this lighting is really giving. Um, but it's also shining real bright in my eyes. My skin is really giving. Y'all want my skincare routine? Um, that's my sister. Anywho, I'm at work. Today is Friday, so today is the last day that we have to um decorate our classrooms. And excuse me, I know I closed out the video on Wednesday. Ooh, hold on. Okay. I know I closed out the video on Wednesday, like two days ago, um, because it was back to school night and stuff, but I do still have a couple things I need to do, actually, um, still never put that card up, um, I have a whole, like, list on my desk in my, uh, classroom, because I made sure I did a to-do list for me tomorrow so I can get it done, um, and I want to be really ready for, like, the first week of school. And I'm not talking about first day of school. I'm not talking about first two days of school. I want to be ready for the first week of school. Because what I look like only being ready for one day. Not. Um, if you know me, you know I stay on my stuff. So, I just wanted to come on here. And then I'm going to probably just reveal to y'all the final, final, final. Oh, excuse me. Final review of my classroom um, and all of the details. I post the video. And again, if you're new to this channel, um, let me know how you liking it. Let me know how you like this content. Let me know if you want to see more of this content. Uh, if you want some different content, like just let me know. Obviously, I'm not the only person still decorating stuff because literally the assistant principal has her whole trunk full of stuff. I guess she's gonna be decorating her office. Um, but uh, yeah, I was trying to see if my mother was gonna pull up with me or not. My boss has breakfast for y'all. Let me tell y'all, hold on. Let me tell y'all about my department chair, y'all. Science department, science department is the best department. You feel me? Like my department chair, she looks out for us all the time, y'all. 
all the time so this year like i got her something for her birthday last year but this year i really want to put some thought in it like more thought into it or whatever i'm gonna get her a gift card i'm probably gonna go around see if we can collect some money because i'm not gonna lie my department chair goes in and she's literally right next door to me like she's the classroom next door to me and when i tell you that she like she just really looks out for you no matter what she chill she chill vibes all the time she don't do too much you feel me like i couldn't have been blessed with more of a better department chair like as long as you're on your stuff i feel like she's fine and even if you most people who aren't on their stuff whatever she's still chill like she should be hard on you and you should be thankful that she's not hard on you but little she's chill she's chill she got us breakfast this morning y'all she's like she literally sent it last night she's like i'm gonna have breakfast in my room y'all want to stop by whatever i'm gonna have juice coffee bagels what you don't have to do that and like the last couple days of school last year or whatever i forgot what it was that might have been like ice cream day or something like that like national ice cream day or something like that i don't know but she got us rita's like five different flavors and they stayed in the freezer girl let's believe i was snacking on it because it's she's right like i said she's right next door to me so we share refrigerators together and stuff so anything i need she's right there for me like i'm not gonna lie shout out to you shout out to you i'm not gonna put your name out there but shout out to my department chair she really a real one for real no lie let me know let me check where my mother is and get inside this building so i can get started because i don't do too much talking so i can go get my breakfast and then get started you feel me you feel me what it do y'all um, different setting different lighting um what am i saying update i'm pretty much finished all my decorations but i just got another hot glue gun to put up stuff on my wall because it wasn't sticking it was getting on my nerves and somebody advised me to use hot glue gun instead so we're gonna try another hot glue gun because the initial hot glue gun didn't work um so yeah so now we're at my mom's office we're printing because it's after lunch time didn't even eat lunch y'all definitely hungry i got everybody eating lunch around me but nobody giving me lunch you feel me and now i kind of want i kind of want chick-fil-a but Okay, I kind of want Chick Fil A, um, but like nobody else is giving me. Oh, let's go get Chick Fil A vibes. And now I want hip hop chicken. So I want like a chicken box. I don't know what I'm gonna eat. I think I'm gonna wait till I just get home and see if my boyfriend wanna get some food. Cause it's Friday, y'all. Turn up. What a hoe. Who went here trying to get nine? Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, yeah. Mm, mm. It's a five minute long video. Oh, I'm just been babbling. Let me get off here. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm just kidding. All right, y'all. So it's the end of the day. It's currently three thirty. I was off at three ten. Right on my mouth. Um, I did not show y'all the final product, but I will on the first day of school. Um, and I'm gonna do like a little, I'll probably do two different videos, so stay tuned for that next video because it's gonna be my outfit of the day, um, for my first day of school, and it's gonna be the review, the room review. So, yeah, so at that being said, it's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed decorating my classroom with me, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can notify as I post a video. And don't forget to stay true, stay you, and stay blessed.